How's it going everyone? And welcome back to Sleep by the Hearth. Where today we're gonna be continuing our Super Mario Maker level that we were working on. So let's get going with some adventure time, shall we? So uh it's been quite a few days since I've actually even had the chance to do this, so I don't even remember what I'm trying to make to be honest. But I I know what the level is like, because I was actually showing it to some of my friends. So they seem to like it. So hopefully when it's all done, you will too. So where did we leave off? Let's just scroll on through. I know we have the pipe world, but as far as everything else, we just started kind of getting the lay of the land as far as the regular thing goes. So this is all the secret, which is all well fun. But you know, we also want to have some regular fun too. Let's move on right down here. So, one thing I noticed is if you were to just start the game as is, go ahead and give it a shot here. Get yourself power up, it's always really good. There's a problem. All these cannons, the idea they're not behind them nice, they lead right to the clouds. So, in essence, cannons don't really serve much of a purpose. The ideas that we once had might not be so good later. Or, what we could do, we could actually take them and move them somewhere else. So, we don't need to throw them out. We just need to reposition them. Once they're properly grabbed, of course. Come on. Stay with it. There we go. Now we can move this all the way right here. I accidentally touched this one, so we're just going to put it right back. And there we are. But watch. Might have to, you know, fill in that gap with something else though. Not been too crazy. Let's see. We have a pipe and that. Tell you what. Pretty standard part of any Mario level. It's gonna be some pipes with some enemies. Why not do that? I'll do that. Go in there. And then we'll even put another one right here. Oh, that looks pretty silly. Those pipes, they don't have anything to stand on. So, uh, let's see. Oh, that looks like I got uh, the Apex Predator in chat. Because I hate Hearthstone so much. Well, good thing we're playing Mario Maker then. But, uh, I feel like I've seen you on the stream before watching Hearthstone. I'm kind of surprised that you would watch previous streams. Maybe I'm thinking of somebody else, but... Apex sounds very familiar. Alright. Okie doke. So let's put some ground underneath these. Make it look a little more uh, uniform. Yeah, just like that. In fact, it's as low as we can go, right? Yeah. Just about. I'll tell you what. We're gonna take this, put it over right here. And we're gonna put some more ground right in there. And we're just gonna have this. And we're just gonna fill it. There. Oh. I must uh I must have accidentally touched the mouse. I didn't mean for that to happen. Okay. Okie doke. So, uh, da, da, da. where was I? Oh, that's right. What we're gonna do here, we'll drop a Mr. Green Shell out. And he's just gonna do his own thing. Because he's a Green Shell, he's gonna just walk over the edge. You're gonna wanna pick up a Green Shell. You can put a little Goomba in there. You're gonna pick up the Green Shell. And then. Pick this one up. One ups don't actually serve a purpose. They're in the game. They make some fun. So watch what I'm about to do. Look at your green shell. Now they're gonna keep coming out. You just gotta go up here. And then boom. Oh, unfortunately, uh, you don't get to keep it. But you know what? We're just gonna leave it like that. Alright. 
fixed pressure Sienna. I got a pretty solid deck in arena. Just got dis destroyed every time. No, my luck, my enemy had 1 HP and had 4. Oh god. Uh, he dropped a matter bomber. Yeah. Unfortunately, that's uh, one thing that Hearthstone falls short on a lot is people make fun of the RNG. That's why you'll see uh, people make fun of how it's in the, the esports scene and whatnot. So yeah, I gotta, I gotta pinch my pennies, cause uh, this Elgato game capture is pretty good, but unfortunately it doesn't do 60 frames per second, unlike the new one. I could try selling this one and putting money towards the uh, 60 FPS one. I know in today's world, unless you're doing 60 FPS, there's, there's no reason to to exist anymore, you know. I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, we don't have enough of. Where do I find it? Where did I put it? There it is. I'm just gonna put in some little clouds. The inner Bob Ross will be very happy. So, we have that. Now the other problem, is you can easily jump up there. So, uh, we're gonna have to change that. We're gonna have to take these clouds and erase them. All but those two. There you go. And we'll leave that little gap right there. In fact, yeah, we'll leave that gap right there. And we'll even put a little, uh... Oh, come on. I was holding down a button I didn't need to hold down. Put a little note there. For funsies. No reason. You don't always need reasons for everything. Alright. Apex saying, I picked a hunter, got Dr. Boom as my first draft. Apparently I suck at making decks. Nah, dude, arena is, arena is terrible. I hate arena. I usually get for really bad drafts in arena. Like, hey man, you got the Dr. Boom. Sometimes I don't even draft arenas, or draft legendaries. A funny story, I know uh, people here for the Mario Maker probably don't care for the Hearthstone bit, but I do both, so I gotta kind of deal. In the meantime, we're gonna, we're gonna test this bit right here. But uh, one time, during the original Goblins and Gnomes draft, like the first one, I got two Dr. Booms. And I still lost all three games, so what does that tell you? <laughs> yep, Arena's a Arena's an animal. It's not a fun one. Okay. I'm trying to think what I want to do with these cannons. To be honest, I don't really know. In fact, I think I'm going to make them upward facing. I think I have a more fun idea than firing over. And the neat thing is, I mean, a lot of you who have Mario Maker know this. For those of you that don't, you know, uh, and you plan on getting it, you know, easily make a copy of something. All you have to do is hold down the L trigger and it'll just make copies. I love that little feature. Okay, so we got clouds up here, so this would actually be a bad thing if you think about it. We don't want cans going up there, so we might have to scrap the cans for now. Okay, it wasn't really a huge intensive thing. We can always, uh, come back to it at a later date. Okay, so what we are gonna do, instead, is some on some donuts. Just some quick donut platforms here. Why not? One of those things. You're either gonna do it, or you're not gonna do it. In my opinion, it's always better to just do it. You won't regret it. Not at all. Now, in our mushroom, we're going to place that right down here. Then we make it a little bit shorter, though. In fact, we'll make it even, if we can, make it even shorter. Just like that. And I could grab another one. I can shake it to make it different colors. The same kind of mushroom. It's just a little uh, different in terms of color. That's all. All right. You don't always have to do this, but usually it's a good time because you can get what I like to call loss in creation, where you go on a, on a really nice level and you just don't really think like, hey, you know, how's it play from the beginning? Sometimes you gotta go back and check, especially when it's been a while. You know, like me and this one today. So we just put this one in. You know this. It gives you that, but it doesn't. It's just like a mini trick. 
Not that the lives really matter. We should add some enemies to this. In fact, we should add nothing crazy. One of them. Need a wing. That way, you have another use for the shell. Because if you want, you can go back and be like, hey, I need another turtle. Let's go get one. Oh. There you go. Fortunately, you gotta be kinda skillful with the shells. Sometimes I can uh, forget that. There we go. Because we don't have Fire Flower, I'll just go boop. And get him just like that. There we are, Yoshi. There we are. And we're gonna choose the not cloud route this time, because, well, we already know what happens when we go the cloud route. I'm just all over the place. I'm not using the D-pad right now, I'm actually using the uh, thumbstick. Which I usually use the D-pad. Okay, we can go this way. All kinds of things. I'll tell you what we need. I'll tell you what we need right up here. Go ahead and edit. Yeah, add a nice big old chain chomp. Everyone loves chain chomps. Chain chomps are amazing. They're simultaneously very scary. And... Very cute. Let's get all these Mario shadows out of the way. There we are. Now he can attack you down here. So, we got a little bit of a safe side. However, not the safest, because you're gonna have... You're gonna have a Koopa Troopa. But not just any Koopa Troopa, nope. You're gonna have a Koopa Troopa with a spike. So you can't just jump on him, so you have to make a choice. Now granted, Yoshi could just eat him. Not even a big deal. What do we gotta do? I'll make some other choices. Oh. Let's, uh, let's expand on that idea, shall we? Ooh. This is a bit of a toughie. But given the powers that you have so far, it should be pretty easy for you. I think Cooper Troop is already selected, right? Guess not. Gotta find him somewhere. Where is he? Sometimes my eyes get lost. There we are. I'm gonna put a Koopa Trooper there. I'm gonna give him a set of wings. I'm gonna go ahead and stack him on up. Can you see that little bounce there? You know they're nice and stacked. Alright, so we got that. In itself isn't too bad. But now, on top of all that, and you can get crazier. We'll put a hammer bro. Now granted, by now, you'll probably have your Yoshi. And you'll probably have your flower. So it's really not all that scary. But at the same time, those hammers, that can throw you off. So you gotta, you gotta be careful. Let's see. Easy as that. And then... Just go whop. Easy peasy. Not so level so far. Nothing bad. Except when you fall. And then it's a little bit bad. Alright. So. Uh, we don't have to keep the goal all the way over here, by the way. We could move it back if we're kind of done. I don't know if I want to be done yet. We don't really have a whole lot to really call on Mario level. Let's zoom all the way back. We got all this. That's always fun. What else do we want to see in this? Um, that's a good question. That is a good question. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to insert spring block. But first, first we need some ground. In fact, I have an idea. I'm going to borrow an idea from Super Mario Bros. 3. I'm going to, uh, first off, lay down just some regular... Some regular ground. In fact, we're gonna lay down a lot of it. Might not even use all of it. We're gonna put it down. And then we're gonna get cooking. We got blocks right here. And we got blocks right there. And now 
Yeah, I'll select that. Oop. Didn't mean to do that. Perfect. So, Super Mario Bros. 3, you say? Yes. We're gonna start creating our little uh, tunnel here. And we're gonna have a shell we can kick right in. So, drops down. Then, nope, not that. We need to go back to the block. So, trying to think here. Oh, yeah. There we go. And that's just kind of a zigzag based on what you want to do. Just gonna do that and that. Nope, nope. Need that one, I think. I think I'm doing the right order. Yeah, two and then two and then two and then and then that, I think. Probably count that wrong. That's why we test. A boom. Oh. And that's what happens. Why you test. Test everything you do. Even even testing the test apparently. There we go. Now it doesn't shatter them like it does in Super Mario Bros. 3. That is perfectly fine. However, the uh, unfortunate part is that the uh, blocks will start to undo themselves here. So we gotta keep that in mind. I'm trying to think. How could we make this better? I don't really know. Hmm. <clears throat> That's tricky. I could change it to a Super Mario Bros. 3, but the problem is, I already have uh, Yoshi, and Yoshi's home in Super Mario World. And I already have a few other elements as well that won't carry over. So we gotta keep what we got. It is what it is. So sometimes when an idea doesn't work, you gotta scrap the idea. It's never fun. That's how you learn. You know, it's like Bob Ross always said, you don't make mistakes, you make happy accidents. I'm trying to think, what, what could we do out of this? What could we really do? I think I have an answer. We're gonna fill this with blocks. And then, what we're gonna do, we're gonna do that. And then, on top of that, This will be tricky. In fact, this will be trickier than I thought. In fact, no, it won't. We'll be fine. We'll be just fine. What we're gonna do, I probably shouldn't, uh, go ahead and undo a couple of those steps. The undo button's your friend. There we go. This should be fine. Just like that. Let's retest how that works. Just in case. I have to, uh, Shorten the gaps. Alright. It's getting on through. Doing its thing. Almost there. Perfect. So here's what I'm thinking. Watch this. Put a P switch right down here. And we take this one, we delete it. And put an invisible block right here. In fact, I wanted to test something early when I was at work. We could get to see if it ever works right now. Let's go ahead and test this little theory. And we can see what I'm talking about in just a moment. I'm pretty excited to see if it works, to be honest. I'm actually testing two things. One, to see if I, if I made this right. Two, to see if I can get the invisible block. i to find out. Oh, well, now it's gonna go right over it. Unless, yeah, we actually have to cut out this one right here. Fortunately, I have to test the whole thing over again. Not all tests can be short. But, uh, you know. Oh, oh, I accidentally uh, erased some ground. Hopefully, hopefully, that won't be a problem. We'll find out in a moment. We're almost there. Yep, nope. Oh. Yeah, I was really hoping the shell would, uh... 
was really hoping the shit would kick in and get that P-switch. I don't think it's gonna happen. Alright. Well, never mind then. I guess that's not happening. But, uh, let's get you back. Right, let's do that. Uh, one thing I do want to know. Nah, it won't work. Oh well. This whole thing. Oh my god. Yep, I keep erasing when I don't need to. Oh, this whole thing needs to be scrapped. But you know, we're just gonna leave it in. We're gonna leave it in for funsies. Tell you what. Tell you what we'll do. Um. Maybe we'll just put a door down here. What are we gonna do with the door? Well, funny you should ask. Funny you should ask. I'm gonna put it. Tell you what, make it really funny. Put our door all the way up here. When you go through it, all that you're gonna get, you're gonna go right down here. Isn't that funny? Sometimes you just gotta do funny little things even if they don't make sense. All right, let's go ahead and test this one. See if I can get that invisible block. Oh! I cannot activate invisible blocks unless I hit them from underneath. Good to know. In fact, yeah, we'll just, we'll just, you know, we'll just leave it in. It's a little, uh, it's a little treat for those who, for those who want it, I guess. So, let's recap real quick. Didn't do much. Put those little donuts in. Add that little thing in. Tell you what. I saw this earlier. I want to see how this works. Kind of curious. I think the only thing that makes it happen is I can't stomp on the wizard. Outside of that, that's about it. That's fine. Alright. See. Tell you what we could do. We can. Hmm. I don't know what we can do. Sometimes you're gonna have writers block in the middle. You're making Mario's. That's just gonna happen. So, well, when you get writer's block, you do what you do best. Oh, apparently it's not shaking. Just gotta give him a little mushroom. He's gonna go right here. And he's gonna go... He's gonna go right here. How are you supposed to defeat that? Good question. like that. You're gonna jump up on the note blocks, of course. And you're not gonna get hit by the hammers, because you're too good for the game. Except, you know, you'll probably clear faster than I will. Alright, we got that. You know what? You know what? Well, we have to do at least clear here, so we'll put a block right there. Signify that's where the end of our level is. We have all those guys. So after that, quite a bit of ground to cover. So, what should we do? Well, let's put it in the ground. We need it. You can hear the little song singing along. Okay. All right. Now, there we are. We got this guy. He's all fine and dandy. But 
Why don't I just add some shrimp wings? Just for some crazy fun times. And then add some more flying Koopas. Flying Koopas are fun. I highly recommend them. A little Goomba. And then... <laughs> it's not very artistic when it comes to drawing letters, I guess. Yeah, no. I'm gonna get spelled out yay, but I'm very impatient, so uh, so that's not gonna end. Sneaky Spack says, hey again, and I say, hey to you. Tell me just in time, we're doing some Mario Maker. In about four minutes, we're gonna end this episode, but we're staying on Twitch. We're not going anywhere for Twitch. I'll tell you what, let's do, why not just a bunch of coins? You earned it. You earned it. Who doesn't like a bunch of Mario coins? Coin Central Station right here. Let's get coin crazy. And those two coins can just stay up top. Why not? We'll finish off that one right there. Act. I don't think I need one more. Technically, I messed that up, but we could just do. No. Don't ask me the point of that. <laughs> I really don't know. I really don't. Okay, well, we're gonna put a bunch of these here. I'm not gonna have anything. Just gonna have coins. Like this one, and then a couple coins. All right. Sneaky Spaxel says, "Cool, good that I have Super Mario Maker and Wii U right here next to me." Yeah, you can create along. It's like a, it's like when Bob Ross says, "Like, hey, you can paint alongside me." And you can create alongside me too. And we're actually about to start a brand new level. I just finished this one. Hold on, I'm just gonna take a quick drink, real quick. Nice and tasty. All right. So of course, I'm gonna try to upload it now. So what do you gotta do? First thing, do the thing I haven't been doing the entire time, saving. Saving is probably the most important step. After we test it and upload it. So right now it's gonna be my 10th upload spot. All right, let's go ahead and clear ourselves a course. Adventure time. I'm going to take the uh, the easy route, for those who might not know the secret from last time. The secret, you'll find yourself, or just watch the first episode. I actually don't need that show. Even though we have a, a jumper right here. I just, oh, I can just be bad at the game. That's fine. That's perfectly okay. We have our cape. Oh man, we got our hammer bros. Unfortunately, we don't lose everything. Yeah, we're just gonna keep losing it. Lost too much. Alright. What's in this door? I mean, I don't technically need the shell to find out. The shell's just kinda it's kinda there as an afterthought, really. There we go. And you get your right next to it. Ooh. Let me get the big hammer bro. Oh. It's gonna go ahead and knock me out. That's not very nice. Oh, don't worry, I had a treat for him. Call just leaving. Got all these guys. I'm good for now. There we go. Easy peasy. You don't always need a hard Mario level to make it fun. Sometimes it's just nice to have a little, a little relaxing level. 
And my uh my thing is outside of the gimmicks that I have uploaded. I'm not gonna call it Adventure Time. We are gonna expect some kind of Adventure Time theme. Um, let's just call it. I don't know. Call it cool beans. Because I'm not feeling very creative right now. Unfortunately. Oh. Looks like, uh. Hmm? You know how a gamepad is using another controller? What's going on with the stream? Stream working? Okay. It says it's upload complete. Stream. Oh, I guess the stream was just like combined. Alright, well, I left it up on the screen for a while. Hopefully, that'll be enough time. If you want, I can, uh, I guess type it out in chat, but I left it up there for a while. So, uh, hopefully, it's enough time. If not, I can go back and get it. So, as far as the YouTube side of things, it's gonna end this episode. Episode 2. Go ahead and check out episode 1 if you missed out the first one. And for those watching Twitch, it's uh, look up the uh, Sleep by the Hearth on YouTube, and that's where I'll be. You'll see Rain Maker, only one other one so far, and a ton of Hearthstone content. But on Twitch side, I'm going to keep continuing. Bye, uh, you two guys. I'll see you in the next one.